Good morning, everybody. Good morning. I wonder when you sang the last song, the last line, uh, not one soul have helped to have salvation in the world. I think, I can imagine, it will be very horrible. As a follower of Jesus Christ in a lifetime, and you fail to lead even one soul, that will be, to me, I can only say by myself, uh, I can feel very horrible and shameful. <clears throat> but uh, by the grace of God, I think if the people they are baptized, they will be by thousands. Okay, today, no Bible truth, faultless. This is <coughs> Maxine, Chinese English. We call Bible truth, truth in the Bible, of the Bible. <laughs> But according to a Chinese culture, Bible truth, Shenzhen Zhenli, Bible truth, a faultless, make no mistake. <coughs> As I said uh, in uh, 10 o'clock, once in a while, we go to New Mulan, big restaurant, and we go to Sikwa. And around the world, Especially to the end, if you get stay at ancient all the way to the end, big screen. And very often they show advertising of uh, a <coughs> law firm, lawyers. And I count the picture with the people, law lawyers, okay? Eleven. I don't know why they don't take it 12 or 10, <laughs> 11, or more so subjectable, okay? 11, as uh, advertising for business. Hey, Peter, you want to watch out. But in your plan, you don't. <coughs> it is wrong diagnosis. They treat patient, not accurate and wrong treatment, medicine. Mm -chan, mm -yi. Okay? You, you treat it wrong. Number one, money-making business for lawyers. So as a doctor, you want to watch out. That's their number one money-making advertising. Okay? You treat your patient wrong and you keep your medicine wrong, there will be big money for them. Number one. I always remember this occasion when the old brother G is here. You should still remember, right? Okay? Brother and sister G. <coughs> At one time, he was hit by a car but not very serious. Somehow, the lawyer sued for money. So, he win a few hundred dollars, I think. And because his English is not good, so he asked me to accompany him to the lawyer office to get the money that they him. Hey, Peter, you know how much the lawyer made? 70%. The lawyer makes 70%. He got, he got hit, and he got 30%. I thought 50 50 would be stiff enough, right? Hey, Freddie, do you listen to me? 50 50, 50 should be stiff enough. I cannot, I cannot believe it. 70%. Uh, I always remember for life, as I said, that is my all-time impression. Lawyer makes 70%, and one who can hit me only 30%. So you have to be very careful, Rabbi, very careful. 
if they if they sold to win money, they get seventy percent. You only get thirty percent, <laughs> but you have to suffer. Okay, that's connected with it here. You have to treat correctly, <laughs> treat uh, and uh, prescribe your medicine accurately. The idea is you don't get sued when it comes to saving souls. That's according to what we believe, according to what says in the Bible, it's much more important. Physical life is only, let me give you 150 years, but eternal life is eternal, unlimited hour of life is more accurate. You have to be very accuracy, very important, because Bible too can save souls and also keep souls sanctified. Okay? As I say, by the grace of God, we are all still here. For myself, it's 70 some years now. The first day when I heard about Jesus and learned to follow Jesus, that's over 70 years. For you guys, maybe 30, 40, 50 years, uh, <clears throat> but still a long time. And we are still here, that's the point. Sanctified has something to do with it. If we don't feel sanctified, we drop out a long time ago. Lots of people drop out. They fail to live a sanctified life. At least when you bear the name Jesus believers, if suddenly fear the pressure, fear the need that you have to live a different life to glorify God, you have the responsibility to wear that name. To know Bible too, faultless, is a must. As I say, as a doctor, you have to prescribe right medicine. You have to know <coughs> what happened, what kind of illnesses. Just by the grace of God, I found Peter is a very good doctor. I can just tell him what I feel here or here or somewhere. He knows, just to buy out of the counter, you buy medicine and you are okay. So he is very good on this one. By the grace of God, we have a good doctor here. As I say to lawyers, your, <laughs> their big money making is that you make it for. By the grace of God, nobody ever sued me for giving advice uh, wrong or antagonize them or make them feel so bad. <clears throat> but if we don't do it right, we get it wrong on the scripture, then we will become all the people in Matthew chapter 7, Matthew chapter 7, 22 to 23. Jesus called them evil doers. What did they do? They, call, they say to Jesus, Lord, Lord, that's at the time of praying to God, Lord, Lord. And then they work miracles, lots of them. And then they cast out demons, lots of them. But Jesus said at the end, you evil doers, I never knew you, depart from me. In nowadays, just simply, I don't knew you, you go to hell. That's nowadays expression, simpler and easier to understand. You people go to hell, I don't know, okay? They believe Jesus all their life, work a lot of miracles, did a lot of good work, but evil doers. The one thing that I can think of is they did not handle the Bible correctly. They may be shouting so loud, Jesus is Lord. They may be preaching so bold, but mistaken. Bible 2, Bible 2 can also keep souls sanctified, clean. <clears throat> For unto this end was the gospel preached even to the dead. 
Now, here, in our, in our audience right here, every one of us, we know what is dead mean. That means those who do not believe Jesus. But today, I will tell you one more thing. Recently, I encountered a uh, Southern Baptist preacher. He's a young man. Uh, but he's uh, on YouTube. He was preaching very boldly. And he has other resources, information, and pictures. Very wonderful. But after I heard his preaching, at the last, he had a telephone number picked up. So I wrote a few lines and clicked to him. I said, do you know this verse, this verse? And then very soon, every time when I send message, he replied right away. So I can imagine he must have workers, a group of workers work for him. <clears throat> He's a preacher from the Southern Baptist. <clears throat> yeah, in fact, one thing you might want to know. This morning, right outside of the church building, and we have the hydrant, right under the hydrant, on the roadside, not on the sidewalk, on the roadside, I found a booklet. The first time I see something like this, it said, True Baptist Church. I never heard of anyone come up with a true Baptist Church. Casilla and 46th Avenue, close to the highway, 495 Highway, 46th Avenue, down there. True Baptist Church. Baptist Church everywhere. We have had all kinds of Baptist church, but now suddenly I found a true Baptist church. <clears throat> what I'm talking about is nowadays I feel that I can see they are dead. These are all dead people. And even last night I sent up one message, text message. And my last comment is I don't understand myself. I know this is useless, but how come I still click this message to you? Or you figure it out. Maybe Peter figure this out. I just fear I want to uh, send this message to this preacher, to this someone. But at the same time, I feel that it's hopeless. These people will not change. They cannot change. They will not change. But I still text message to them. Something is she preaching to the dead. Imagine, okay? Think about that. Preaching to the dead, knowing that they will not listen. Knowing that they, will, they cannot listen. But I still send message to them. Scriptures. Preaching to the dead. I'm just giving you what happened, okay? Something looked like preaching to dead people. And men be just in the flesh so that their soul can live according to God. Since I discovered it first, I like it, I appreciate it. So I use it very often. Because we all like to know Instantly, right now, good or bad, as I told you guys, if I be a doctor, I want to be a surgeon. One reason is you cut it out, cut off everything, and you wrap it back up. You know what happened to your patient. This guy is going to live. This guy not going to live. I think the surgeon know better, right? No sooner, right? <laughs> when you open it up. <clears throat> we all like to know something. We desire to know and we will know it instantly right now. 
And that's why I appreciate it. In the press right now, we can judge this person is dead or alive. Uh, I feel that I will continue to text message to this guy because he has answered immediately and I like that one. Immediately he answered. I see that you have some different insight. He can say that in Bible knowledge he discovered I have some different, unique <coughs> understanding. Maybe he is beginning to be curious. How come I found this and I found that? And out of all the resources that he gathered together and put it on his video, I said I want to help him to be a, a, a little bit more biblical. <coughs> be judged on the, in the flesh right now. So that they can live according to God. But set facts upon us all. <clears throat> Bible translators has been taken captive by Satan to do his work. Somehow you guys are very blessed. Somehow Robin make it here. I always say somehow. I always like to play with on Robbie. <laughs> I appreciate that he is here. Captive. Chinese translation cannot see this meaning. Not in the Chinese translation. Bible translators, they were captive by Satan to do its well. That's horrible. Today I will show you how very simple. But it takes the Lord's servant to do this following the Lord's servant. It takes someone like that. <clears throat> the Lord's servant must not strive, be gentle towards all, even to dead people, knowing that they will not believe. Knowing that they will not change, but I still have a feeling I want to help him. Preaching to the dead, maybe this is one way to look at it. And I love this word because it's simple, A, B, C, and it's good meaning. Act to teach, forbearing. You see, patient, patient, patient. I've been uh, praying for someone for 60 years, still not seeing any result. So, to get one soul, take one soul with you to see God, the day you see God, at least you take one soul with you. It's not easy. In meekness, correcting them that oppose themselves. It proactive. For eventual, okay. I almost know, don't know how to read this word. This is per adventure. God may give them repentance unto the knowledge of the truth. See? Knowledge of the truth. It takes someone who really know the truth and know how to bisect the truth, handle the truth, to help this kind of people. Where can we find Bible teachers that can handle our right Bible words? This is not easy. And let me advise everyone else not in this church. You have to be in a church of Christ. Or the better way to put it is, you have to be in a, the church Jesus Christ promised to build. Jesus has said, I will build my church, that church. I will build my church, that church. <clears throat> In that church, you can find this kind of preacher. Do your best to present yourself to God as one approved 
a workman who does not need to be ashamed handle the word of God are right that's most important that's my desire and my prayer to God all these 60 some years in preaching I will find the original text originally that meaning <clears throat> correctly handle the word of truth the KJV will say are right okay to the interior the scripture to the intent the, trans, the English translation is pretty good to the intent that now to the principality and the power in the heavenly place that's the church of Christ might be made known through the church the meaningful wisdom of God remember this underline make known to the world, to the people everywhere, through the church, the meaningful wisdom of God. This is in God's eternal purpose, yeah, right here. This is God's eternal purpose. This is why Jesus came to say, I will build my church. To build a church so that God will deliver the truth into that church. And through that church, make known the wisdom of God. Right here, the scripture. Ephesians chapter 3, 10 to 11. I appreciate this verse. Uh, our, I will have some more study on this one in the uh, retreat. Yeah, next Sunday will be the last day to sign up. Hey, Freddy, Freddy, <laughs> you can come to a, a sign up for, for the <laughs> retreat. Okay, according to the eternal purpose, which he proposed in Christ Jesus our Lord, this is the scripture. God's eternal purpose is to advance the church, and through the church, the meaningful wisdom of God will make known to all the people in the world. That's God's eternal purpose. But reality is our point of us. Satan, trans, uh, Bible translator, have been taken captive by Satan to do his will. In my generation, in all the last 1500 years, in Western Europe, in all Europe, in America, all the theologians, especially Bible translators, captive by Satan to do his will. Today I will show you very simple example. The most deadliest one is using synonym words to hide God's original intended meaning. All they need is synonym words to hide the original intended meaning. Very subtle and very wicked. But as I always say that, when it comes to recognize American money currency, even one cent the one cent is, we call it brass or we call it copper. Copper, right? The cent is some kind of thing. You see, sometimes we have a fake one. People can see one cent, then they recognize a four cents. But when it comes to recognize the Bible, synonym, look, all very alike and then they will fool everybody nobody is discovered <clears throat> such as 1st Corinthians chapter 1 verse 10 let's look at it I appear to you brothers in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ that all of you agree with one another 
everybody understand same way. Say it same way. Preach the same thing. Nobody preach anything otherwise. So that there may be no division among you. And that you may be perfectly united in mind and thought. See that? In mind and thought. Wonderful. Mind and thought. You know why we have mind and thought? Because we have soul and body. You have mind and thought, soul and body. But the point is here, division, the word division. The word division, they change the word <coughs> denomination into division. Originally, today, English expression in non-go division is denomination. I search <coughs> At least about 10 years, I mean 5, 10 years ago, I searched Google, Google search, and <coughs> division, denomination, all came up as synonym words. But today, I try to do the same thing, no longer. They don't answer anymore. <coughs> I think Google has been controlled by denomination because of my asking all these synonym words they changed <clears throat> but at the beginning I found division division fractions denomination same denomination same, same, same words same meaning in English in Chinese we have this. We call this synonym word. Where is the word? Synonym word, it will come down. And the deadlier of the deadlier is people cannot discover. They don't understand. But I had discovered and I shared. Out there, they are all dead. I'm preaching to the dead. Literally to the dead. Dead set in their mind. Dead in their feeling. Dead in their going to the number three churches. Their feeling is dead. Their understanding is dead. And this is very deadly of the dead. Is they don't even discover. The day you find a Bible translated this word as denomination by it. I bought every one of them. I found I found a Bible published by Southern Death Baptist. They have resource. They published that Bible. And I found it only in Chinese. Not in English. In Chinese. So, what do you think? It takes this kind of preacher, this kind of worker, because I because I search it carefully, I read every line, and I found it in Chinese. Okay? Fan Zhong Pai. I found this Fan Zhong Pai. I bought all of them. It's expensive. 25, 30 years ago, it's also already cost you, hey, <laughs> David, $95 USA. New Testament only. New Testament. And later, a few years later, I try to buy it again. Bankrupt. <laughs> no, no longer. Nobody buy it. But I bought whatever I can. Whatever they came out. When I went to Hong Kong, I went to a religious bookstore. See if this, this Bible. 
They have three, four, I bought it, I bought three, four, all of them. And then when I went to Colombo, uh, Colombo, right? Singapore, Colombo, there. I found two or three. I bought all of them. Okay, wherever I go, whenever I bought it. And I bought it to China. Give it to the library, to their library. And I found in Beijing, the other school, they had it in a bag. Okay? Ninety-five dollars. Twenty-five, thirty years ago. Already worth that much. But now you cannot buy anymore. Not on eBay, not anywhere. And I found synonym words. Now let's go to number two now. Therefore, number one is First Corinthians chapter one verse ten. Romans chapter seven, chapter sixteen seventeen. Watch out. Cause division. It should be translated as organized denomination church. I saw it. I found it. Your blessing. It should be denomination church. And the word course should be organized. To nowadays, English expression, if you say organized denomination church, it's an offense contrary to the doctrine in the Bible. Okay? Apostle Paul warned them, watch out, mark them. Those who organize denomination church, they will go to hell. Be careful. As I told you, this morning, right outside, now they even have a true Baptist church. The first time I saw a true Baptist church. It's horrible. <clears throat> they, they use cause division rather than that. Man, let me show you. The Bible said, avoid them. For that they are such, serve our Lord Jesus Christ, but their own belly. And by good works and fair speech, deceive the hearts of the simple. The heart of the simple, what that mean? You don't even think. When you give something, you just take it. Okay? One thing I always do, but you don't, don't follow me, okay? When you pay the bill, like, we pay the bill and they give me change. I usually don't cut, I just put it in the pocket. Hey, David, don't do what I did, okay? I just put it in the pocket, I don't even cut. <coughs> You have to uh, come much better. That's what you call simple. That's what simple means to me, okay? Hey, go to my smile. Okay? That's what simple means. Okay? You don't think twice. Yeah, first piece. <clears throat> we see denomination churches are running their churches as running money making business. I'm very grateful to God. Hey machine, we have to see you. This is my Chinese English expression, okay? <laughs> you can see it right here. Money making business. Okay? They operate the church as money making business. How it works. As I say, anytime, like last week, Saturday, we have so many people. Maybe they know where to give on Father's Day, right? <laughs> Next time, buy a few more. <laughs> but it's okay, okay, does not matter. <laughs> last week, we Saturday, so many people. All filled up. And then. <clears throat> Anytime when I see new people come in, especially men, I want to talk to them. You are coming to church.
to learn about Jesus, Bible to believe Jesus, or your objective is to for the picture to write a letter <laughs> for religious persecution asylum. If you have this need, I can introduce you to that church, to that church. Because in the last 40 years, I had wrote lots of letters. Every letter I wrote, I assume all successful. I assume. Because not one came back. Okay, your letter no good. <laughs> Not one come back to complain. The letter I wrote, useless. That means everyone okay, right? <laughs> a fool, a fool. <clears throat> but recently, they set another rule. The pastor, the preacher, have to verify witness in the court, in the courtroom. They require, they make it one that said to have the preacher there to appear on the court for to verify. I said this preacher only witness for Christ. I don't witness for someone who wants to become American citizen. I witness for people to become a follower of Jesus Christ. But I will witness for some people to become American citizens. I will witness for someone become citizen of the kingdom of God. <laughs> hey, make sure what you think. I will witness for all the people to become citizen of God, but not citizen of America. And I say this, they, they, this church, they have a group of people specialized in helping people like you. You don't want to save this little money. But when you go there, I have told, the people told me that, okay, that each item has a price. You know, each item has a price. Uh, this, how much, this, how much, this, how much. And I did not know. They will pay how much to witness in a courtroom. Hey, one thing you might want to know, you might not want to know. If someone stick to me, 3,000 American currency cash, please go to court because the judge said if you come, he will approve 3,000 cash. I refuse. I said uh, I will not do that even for a million or ten million. It's for your own good. <clears throat> so, my point is you really have lots of churches operate the church as a money making business. Okay, that's my point. They were said 2,000 years ago, Apostle Paul know that. I don't know why did he know, how did he know. Bible said, avoid them, but people running to them. Even myself, I took their hand and guided them to the over there. Because they are going to church is not to believe Jesus. It's so that they can have an excuse to become American citizen. Okay? <clears throat> And that is a different idea. They run to them because they meet each other. Now, here the word cause division should be translated organized, organized denomination church. Now, number three, we come to Titus chapter 3, 10 to 11. You see, they divisive people, they use the word divisive. Want them once, want them a second time, nothing to do with them. For you are sure these people robbed, sinful, self condemned Now, here's the point here. Today, I will make it clear. AIV 
put a divisive person. American standard put a factious man. KJV put a heretic. Divisive, factious, heretic. And what is my point? My point is this. Trans Bible translator discover this word can be translated as divisive, as factious, as even as heretic. Now here's the point. Why not? Denomination. <sighs> Satan is sneaky right here. Why not come up with a Bible, English Bible, denomination, and text this guy to find it in a Chinese word, not in English word, in Chinese word, denomination. You search, I have at least 25 different translations in my office. This is my point. They found this world can be divisive, can be factious, even can be heretic. Why not denomination? When you found denomination, everybody is clear, then maybe some of them will wake up and cut in their heart and change. But it's not the case. That's why my conclusion is what? They have been captured to do Satan's will as Jesus labeled them in John chapter 8, 44. To the Jews who having believed in him, Jesus said they belong to Satan. Their desire is to do what Satan wants to do. That's Bible translator in English over the world, captive by Satan to do its will. When divisive person correctly translated as denominated person, everything becomes clear. ASV put in factors. <clears throat> Why can anyone be dawned to discover? They can put it correctly, intended denomination. Once for all, no one will say. <clears throat> Title chapter 3, 10 to 11. To denomination, translate this way, to denomination people, warn them once, and then warn them the second time. After that, Nothing to do with it. Now, number three. God's eternal power is made known through the, the true, uh, the true, meaningful uh, wisdom of God. Yes, please recognize the church. You see here. Eternal, God's eternal power is made known through the church. See that? The church. The meaningful wisdom of God. The church. Now, Please recognize the church. What church? Number one, the name. Only Chinese people know this one. Because where? Meng Zheng Yin Sun. I will not translate it. There is no English I can translate. Meng Zheng Yin Sun. Okay, only in Chinese culture. I cannot come up with English. Men Zheng Yin Shun. Like Mat Yi Loi Zhui. Mat Yi Loi Zhui. It's things, you know. You light up together, things like that. But in English, there's nothing about that. Entirely different. In English, fat are uh, birds with same feather flat together. But in, in Chinese, mud, yellow, 
there are no no birds in there, no fat at all. It's a different culture. No birds, no fat. Okay? It's different culture. That's why it takes Chinese culture to have the first one. Important. When it comes to uh, when it comes to identification, identification. Number one is the name. The name is Church of Christ. Number two is message of salvation. Sunday worship. What kind of evangelists? And elders, teachers. Now everybody memorize all together seven members. You got it? Put it into your head. The name, message of salvation, name is Church of Christ. Message of salvation what? Mark 16, 16. Believe in that time will be saved. Sunday worship. Especially important. No instrumental music. Fruit of the lips. Evangelists. This kind of evangelists. Okay? <clears throat> Ephesians chapter 4, verse 11. And then your elders. By the grace of God, finally, we have one person you can ask. Elders, what kind of people? Do you know we have a new uh, 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 Barbara's daughter? Barbara's daughter? On one Thursday Bible study, we study elders. What kind of people uh, can be elder? After Bible study finished, I asked her to describe the elder. She got everything very clear. This morning I asked her, do you still remember? She said, yes. In the last 40, 48, 49 years here, we have quite a few men love to be elder. But, B-U-T, okay? One T, not two T. <laughs> but none of them, not one, want to have the qualification. They have the desire to be elder, but not clearly establish their qualification. Titus chapter 1, first Timothy chapter 3. They have qualification. Accumulate those qualifications. But not one willing to. They said, I want to be an elder. Okay? This world is dead. People want to have the prestige, want to have the name, want to have the privilege. But no qualification to mess it up. <coughs> Bible teachers and members. Okay? Remember, the church, this is the church. If we have this seven, if we have this seven, that will be okay. Six years in Hong Kong, I only taught four of them. Now I got seven. <laughs> The name, message of salvation, Sunday worship, what kind of evangelists? Elders and teachers and members. For the grace of God. Uh, David, come to uh, say closing prayer. Thank you.